Hello, I'm Jerry Fort. Going to review some. What am I reviewing? I'm reviewing some brittled nut clusters from the Durham Toffee Company. <clears throat> this is the two ounce bag. They have an eight ounce bag as well. <clears throat> Pouch. Homemade, one small pot at a time, crafted to perfection. So after I check these out, I'm going to read this story. I've read one of their stories. This looks like it's different, so I'm going to read this one after I do this. So if y'all are interested, you like hearing the history of companies, how they evolve from just an idea, um, then stick around after I check them out. <clears throat> made in Durham, North Carolina. Made with North, made with real North Carolina peanuts. So I used to live in South Carolina when I was a young man. <clears throat> Back here, a little, little, a uh, little story. In 2008, as a single mom, I began selling toffee from my cheery little kitchen for extra cash. Over the next eight years, crazy growing demand inspired a dream, the Durham Toffee Company, which officially launched in the Bull, C Bull City in February of 2016. The Durham Toffee Company is a home-based family adventure, and we love nothing more than stirring up sweet gifts and inspiring connection throughout our hometown and beyond. <clears throat> So some people like to know this information, so I like to read this, <clears throat> the nutrition facts. Calories, 260 per pouch, per this little, it says bag. Um, let see, total fat, 14 grams, saturated fat, 3 grams, um, cholesterol, 5 milligrams, sodium, 420 milligrams, total carbs, 28 grams, dietary fiber, 3 grams, Total sugars, 17 grams, includes 17 grams added sugars. Protein, 3 grams. Iron, 1 milligram. Calcium, 1 milligram. Potassium, 208 milligrams. And the ingredients of these is roast, roaster peanuts, sugar, water, butter, flake salt, salt, baking soda, and cayenne pepper. Cayenne pepper. Brittled nut clusters. I am curious about this. <clears throat> okay. Let's check these things out. There's a little, there's a little notch on both sides where you can just rip it, <clears throat> but I'm not really a ripper anymore. <laughs> I'm more of a cutter now. I like, I, I, I cut a lot of stuff. Some of the, some of the ripping I've done of packages has, has, um, wound up the result is, uh, the package ends up destroyed and I can't seal it off very good. Stuff like that, you know. Oh, man. Has that nice toffee aroma. <coughs> you get those roasted peanuts in there. A little butter, cayenne pepper. I can't say I'm getting cayenne pepper. Maybe we'll get it on the maybe we'll get it on the taste. 
I sure wish I had a paper plate in this um, <clears throat> temporary office I'm borrowing here while I work at another campus, just helping them out. And they put me up in here, but I didn't bring anything. I didn't bring anything from my other, from my actual office. So, um, <clears throat> not pretty. Looks like something you get out of Willy Wonka's factory. Mmm. Yeah, smells very, very good. Nice glaze of. What is that? <clears throat> well, their glaze is made up of of uh, water, butter, salt, sugar. So that's what that glaze is on there. But it just kind of looks like a like a caramel coating. Um, but it may be what makes up their toffee. Okay, let's check it out. Very good. Getting a little salt. Getting the toffee. The roasted peanuts. The butter. The sugar. Very good. Very flavorsome. <clears throat> Let me chew it up and swallow it first before I say something else. Very good, very good quality nut cluster. Um, every once in a while, I was thinking I was getting just a little bit of possibly the cayenne, the cayenne pepper, what it is. Yeah, like a little spice, but then, then it went away, so I don't know. So Rebecca, the cayenne pepper, Is it just like a little bit of an extra, like a flavoring thing? Um, I've never heard of it being in, a, in this kind of a, of a candy, so that's kind of different for me. Um, it's a little, um, a little fresh, fresh and, fresh and thing. I still got some left, let me see. Their, <clears throat> their glaze doesn't harden to the point where it's like you're trying to chew concrete. So that's good. It breaks apart easy and melts in your mouth.
I'm enjoying that butter, that butter along with that and the saltiness. Very good. swallow right there yeah I got I got some cayenne pepper on the on the swallow a little bit of heat i think it's just they add a hint of it kind of thing but that's really good there you go so check that out um rebecca is has added a promo code which is jerry 20 for 20 percent off your first order. <clears throat> There's no cutoff date, so you don't have to worry about rushing. But go to their website, check out their, their different products they got, and, uh, and try this out for yourself. It's very good quality candy. Like I said, this is the two ounce package and they have an eight ounce package as well. Okay. Let's see. <clears throat> All right, y'all wanna hear a story? A story. See here? Here's Rebecca hugging a, a bull. A bull. It looks like a bull. <laughs> I don't think it's real though. It doesn't look like it's real. Can't fool me. Okay. <clears throat> Creating beautiful and delicious things makes my heart come alive, always has. In 2008, as a single mom, I began making Christmas confections for gift, for gift cash in my very own kitchen with music and candles. Loved it. And every year, my list of orders grew. My family also grew in 2013 when my two boys and I married my husband, David, and his three girls. Crazy beautiful mess. David loves to dream with and for me. From the very beginning of our story, he encouraged me to take my to toffee big time and, and the seasonal momentum and toffee demand continued to grow. Did I miss something? <clears throat> After a most successful holiday season, 2015, I found myself rather open-minded when a close friend called called with an idea, Durham Toffee. She was so energetically persuasive, she almost convinced me our Toffee could make the Durham Bull, the Durham Bull dance. <laughs> Shortly after, while indulging ourselves at Smitten Boutique downtown, my mother-in-law and I inadvertently found ourselves in Toffee conversation with Smitten's owner, artsy, clever Nancy, who said, Let's launch Durham Toffee right here in my shop for Valentine's Day. I left wondering what had just happened and feeling more than a little divinely nudged. <laughs> I shared this story with David and now we've got this crazy tiger or bull by the tail. We love Durham and are inspired by, by its reawakening, by its reawakening. We hope to spread a bit of beauty and kindness while, while offering something share-worthy to our hometown 
and beyond. So that's Durham, North Carolina. <clears throat> okay. Want to join our adventure? Visit DurhamToffee.com and subscribe to receive our occasional news and sweet deals. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and all by mean and and by all means, had <laughs> that backwards. Eat our toffee, brittled nut clusters, and mashup. Enter code SWEET at checkout for a 20% discount. All right. We got people talking about them here. We'll try to read over that on one of the reviews as well. But there you go. <clears throat> a very, very good quality nut, nut cluster. So it's made in the way of um, peanut brittle, but with nut with nut clusters mixed in with it. There you go. All right. Well, I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you to Rebecca for uh, for sending me this, and I'm anxious to try out the other ones. Maybe I'll get my son to to try the next one with me, and. Um, Y'all, in, in the meantime, go to the website, you guys, and check it out. I take advantage of that 20% discount that uh, Rebecca's offering. And we'll see you all on the next one.